was pretty happy with the swim. It was my first long course meet since um, since Rio, so that's definitely where I'm more comfortable. I I don't I don't love short course, so we had a lot of before short course worlds in December, a lot of short course preparation. So yeah, it felt it felt good to kind of be back doing doing long course swimming, getting ready for worlds this summer. Yeah, it's been good. We had uh, definitely I did a few few events. It was fun to come back to Canada after the Olympics, and there was a lot of excitement just because we had the whole the swim team as a, as a whole had a really really successful Olympics. Our, our girls kicked ass, so that was that was pretty fun for sure. I think anytime you race at home, it just gives you just that little bit extra. And we had we had the opportunity with Pan Am Games in 2015, and and that was that was great. And and we kind of we didn't quite know how Windsor would be. I think Short Course Worlds is a little less as opposed to a multi sport games a little different. So, but we actually had a great turnout. And did a really good job. They kind of had some cool light shows going on with the pool, and, and it ended up being a, a pretty good meet that way. So it was it was a lot of fun to have the home crowd for sure. Uh, I took a couple weeks off after the Olympics. Did a did a bit of traveling, which was good, kind of around Brazil, and then uh, went to Nicaragua with some friends, which was great. Just anytime I can just lay back on the beach in the sun is is that's pretty much my my favorite thing to do. So uh, yeah, we did we did some cool kind of zip lining through the jungle and that kind of thing. A lot of good food, um, good rum. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha